In this video, we are going to solve problem on centrifugal pump where we will calculate work done by impeller of centrifugal pump per unit weight of water. So the question is given as the internal and external diameter of impeller of centrifugal pump are 200 mm and 400 mm respectively. The pump is running at 1200 rpm. The vane angles of impeller at inlet and outlet are 20 degree and 30 degree respectively. The water enters the impeller radially and velocity of flow is constant. Determine the work done by impeller per unit weight of water. So to solve this problem, first I will write down the given data provided where internal diameter of impeller capital D1 is given as 200 mm that is equal to 0.2 meter and outer diameter of impeller capital D2 is given as 400 mm that is equal to 0.4 meter. Rotational speed of impeller capital N equal to 1200 rpm and the blade angle at inlet that is theta is given as 20 degree and blade angle at outlet that is phi is given as 30 degree and here entry of fluid is radial that is 90 degree and velocity of flow at inlet and outlet is constant that means Vf1 equal to Vf2. In this problem we want to calculate work done of impeller per unit weight of water and which can be determined by this formula where we need to calculate values of Vw2 and U2. Therefore, velocity of free light outlet that is Vw2 we can calculate from trigonometric ratio of tan phi because blade angle at outlet that is phi is given in problem as 30 degree. But here we don't know the values of Vf2 and U2 and here in problem they have mentioned that Velocity of flow at inlet and outlet is constant that is Vf2 equal to Vf1 and Vf1 which can calculate from trigonometric ratio of tan theta where theta is blade angle at outlet which is given in problem as 20 degree and again in this equation we need to find out U1 that is blade velocity at inlet and which can be calculated from the formula which we have discussed in previous video that is U1 equal to pi d1n by 60 where T1 is 0.2 and capital N is 1200. Therefore, by calculating this, the value of U1 got as 12.57 meter per second. Similarly, we can calculate for U2 and we will get U2 as 25.13 meter per second. So here I will substitute the value of U1 in order to calculate Vf1. So Vf1 got as 4.58 meter per second which is also equal to Vf2 because velocity of flow is constant at inlet and outlet and with the help of Vf2 and U2 I will calculate Vw2 as 17.2 meter per second. Now we have the values of Vw2 and U2 so I substitute these values in work done formula and we will get work done by impeller per unit weight of water equal to 44.06.